Like, um, who is the Cowboys, like, uh, quarterback? So anyways, do you ever go onto YouTube? No. You know what? There's some funny shit on there. There is! What is your favorite YouTube thing? Ooh, there's a bug on me! Ew, no, where? No, no, it's crawling on me. Oh, it's Bob's. Damn it! I like a bread of that. Oh my god, you me out. Have you ever had crops? Because it sucks. I swear to god, you shave your pussy off, <laughs> you shave all the hair off, and somehow they like crawl up your ass. Have you ever had that? Do you shave your crotch hair? Yeah. Or are you like totally bald or you just like <laughs> butt that? <laughs> oh, so you kind of like, you kind of like manicure it. So or a little triangle or something. Butthole. Oh, you do? How do you do that? Because you know, I like to squat down when I'm in the shower and I just get in there with the. Do you like to use the razors with the double razor or the triple? Because I think the triple gets all of it. I mean, I want to know because you know what? That's how you find out the good shit. Like when you talk about the shit with people. And I use like a cream too. I just <laughs> slather it all over there. I'm not trying to be funny. I want to know. No, but do you use a cream or do you, uh, do you get like the CBS brand or do you get like a good brand of lotion? What, what I mean, well, I'm, I'm going to call you out. What brand do you use? I want to know because I, I'm telling you, I get these bumps sometimes. Oh, so d doesn't it burn though? That might be my herpes, but I'm thinking that like near burn. Would you have sex with a girl that told you that? Wasted, like talking wasted, you know what I mean? And you really were horny. Oh, well, this conversation is over then. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But seriously, I mean, let's, let's pretend like you do drink. If you were just like hyped up on some Red Bull and the girl said that she had a burning sensation, would you still do it if you were really horny? I mean, because I, there's this chick. I'd be kind of wanting to have sex with her, but at the same time, it's like, she's been talking about this nasty so we're gonna move this sinkiness. So should I not do it? She that she's been having a little bit on freshness. I know, but you know what, sometimes there's like that little tuna smell. Do you think that I should give her some Summer's Eve and be like, work it out for her Some Summer's Eve, you know how they have that like, uh, God, like Bahama Blast and all that shit? They have some really good flavors. I'm one of those people that actually got hatched out of an egg. <laughs> they have that new thing going on. <laughs> I know, it sucks. Like, I, I age five times quicker than other people. Do that kind of thing. Do you smoke pot? You don't do anything?
never you had before. I mean. I mean, I don't mean that, like, in the sense of what I just said, but wow. Good for you, I suppose. You ever had anal sex? <laughs> Well, I'm not talking about you shoving your dick up your ass. I had a boyfriend that used to like it up his ass. You know what? I went to an AA meeting once, and it seems like the people that don't drink ever really like some nasty sex. People that don't drink or don't do drugs, they seem Finger, not a pinky or anything? It turns black out like you. I mean, do you like to give it to a girl or a I'm gonna shove your big car. I mean, you know what? You know what I've learned in the years that I've done porn? <laughs> you just shove it up there. Just do it. Do it, you know what I mean? Just fuck them and then, oops, sorry. Shove it up there. It goes a long way, honey. <laughs> a little spit, just spit on it. Talk one on there, just <laughs> shove it up her ass. I had an orgasm once in Vegas when a guy fucked me up the ass. I couldn't believe it. It was fabulous. I was in LA, I was in Vegas for the convention, in the shower. I was hanging out with this new dude. Shoved up my ass. Totally came. So you should do that. <laughs> I mean, I don't want you to do it to me, but I'm telling you, <laughs> as a friend, do it. Because you guys are friends now. Are we friends, honey? You and me, we're here. <laughs> like we've wounded. I get lonely and fires out here and I'm scared and I just need to sometimes be I don't want to burn up in a fire <laughs> it suck, I should think would you come to my funeral <laughs> if I did would you go I'm sure that, like, I mean, I have life insurance, so I'm sure that my family. I have your number now, so they're definitely gonna call you out. But I, hopefully, it won't happen. But it might. It's crazy out here. But we're, we're in LA. Nothing. You never know what's gonna happen. I went and took one of the girls to get a massage the other day, and this guy freaked out. I thought I was going to die right there. <laughs> but I didn't. A couple weeks ago, dude, it was crazy. <laughs> You're not listening? <laughs> this dude freaked out. <laughs> he got kicked out of, like, a liquor store. Started freaking out. And yelling at me. I know. This was, like, a couple weeks ago. I freaked out. <laughs> 